morning and I am the angry cook. This morning, let's do some dessert or breakfast. Um, we're going to do blueberry muffins, fresh blueberry muffins. Not that tough to do. Uh, and they taste awesome. Cut them in half, butter them and throw them in a, in a frying pan for a couple of minutes so they brown up a little bit. They're awesome that way. They're awesome. Just warm. Spread with a little butter with your favorite be beverage, hot or cold. Anyway, what do we need to make our muffins? We need <clears throat> one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, uh, three quarters of a cup of white sugar, two tablespoons of baking powder, two teaspoons of baking powder. Oh my God, it's going to be another one of those days. A third of a cup of vegetable oil, an egg, incredible edible egg, uh, the milk, milk and the vegetable oil and the egg all go together, we'll see that in a minute, uh, a cup of blueberries, and we're going to do a crumb topping on top of that, which is going to use half a cup of white sugar, third of a cup of all-purpose flour, quarter cup of butter, cold butter diced, and one and a half teaspoons of ground cinnamon, and we'll get to that in a couple of minutes too. So uh, first thing we do, preheat our oven. We'll be right back. Hello again, and uh, I just wanted to remind you about our merchandise store. We'll have various things available, including the new design of our t-shirt, which will look very similar to this, but it'll be new along with a couple of extra colors. We have hoodies, we have uh, stainless steel mugs, we have coffee cups in a couple of different colors, three different colors if I remember right. Um, we have uh, long sleeve shirts, we have short sleeve shirts, we have women's t-shirts. We have jogging pants, we have decals, we have some various other things. If there's something you don't see that you want to see, let me know in uh, the comments below, and I'll see if we can get it for you. Um, the link, I, once again, the link will be here. We'll have a couple of pages after this of uh, the merchandise available. Dress like the angry cook. We'll see you. Thank you. Okay. Let's start out big bowl is being used right now. So I got a smaller bowl. So we need one and a half cups of all-purpose flour. AP flour. I just typically just smooth it up against the side. You've seen me do it before. Smooth it up against the side of the bag uh, to level it out. We're going to reuse that in a minute. Put that in our bowl. Then we're going to put in our three-quarter cup of white sugar. Why don't anybody make a measuring set with a three-quarter cup? We use it all the time. It would be handy. Things I think about. Oh, here we come. Hello, my girl. All right, half a teaspoon of salt. We got a cup of flour, sugar, salt. Half a teaspoon of salt. so we don't smash them all up to hell and back. Mix 
mix it nicely. You can do this in a, uh, with a mixer if you want to dirty all that stuff up. You really don't need to. It's, this is not that hard. Okay. That's our oven ready. Third of a cup of vegetable oil. to combine or mix this up a little bit. It's going to be a little tough because the egg yolk refuses to break and the oil and the uh, milk don't want to mix well but we'll do a little bit just to break it break the egg up a little bit more than anything else. There we go. Now we're going to put this in with our wet our dry mixture. Alright, 
I start about three quarters and then I go around and uh, fill the cups with the extra that I have left over. Make your own stuff. Don't pay some schmuck money who doesn't give a crap about his product. It's yours, make it yours. Come on, you. You don't like blueberries. And you know you don't, so don't lick your chops at me. The only way you eat blueberries is if somebody, another dog is eating them too. So I'm afraid you're going to miss out, princess. All right. We're going to put some water in these other cups. About halfway. Give or take. All right. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to make the crumb topping for this. Keep your knives sharp. Butter. Now we're gonna do. Now we're gonna do. Uh, what's that? Half a cup of brown of uh, brown sugar. Jeez. Half a cup of white sugar. Where's my half cup? There it is. Half a cup of white sugar. Third of a cup of AP flour. I just opened this bag, man. I am a bacon fool. Some people contradict that and say I'm just a fool, but I don't know. Third of a cup of AP flour. My booter. And where the hell does cinnamon go? Hello, cinnamon. There it is. One and a half teaspoons of uh, cinnamon. Okay. Now, take your fork or your fingers. I tend to not to like, like to do this with my fingers because the butter is milky. But you just want to make this into like uh, uh, pea crumbly size things. Whatever works out for you. Three, two, one. Okay, we have our crumblies all crumbled. And we're going to place over our, over our muffin. sure it comes out clean. If not, put it in for another five minutes. Another couple of minutes and then keep checking like that. So uh, we'll be back in uh, 20 minutes or so. All right, 25 minutes. Let's keep our face away from the uh, oven this time so we don't get splashed with steam. Ah! You can't see these yet, but you will in a second. See how they burst over the top? Put 
these cool down a little bit, remove them from the pan, put them on a baking rack or something elevated a little bit to uh, get air circulating around them. When they're warm, not hot, but warm, splash some butter on there, make a pot of coffee, and enjoy it. We'll see you next time on The Angry Cook.